So I've been thinking long and hard, and this is my number one piece of advice for people who have yet to start out running their garden business, but are about to. I'm not going to cop out here and just say, go for it, just do it, because you, know, might, you might not necessarily have to do it, or you may, maybe you shouldn't just go for it. You've got to weigh all your finances up, really, haven't you? And, uh, you know, taking the plunge isn't an easy step, because you don't know what's going to be on the other side, you know? It's difficult. But if you do want to go ahead and start up your own garden business, the number one piece of advice that I could give you would be, in the beginning, do what you're comfortable with. Do it well. Build up your customer base. And if you're doing the job well, they'll refer you. What I also, I'll also say, and this is something I did, is occasionally if you get a job that is maybe a little bit out of your comfort zone, and a little bit, maybe you haven't done it before, but you probably know what you you know what to do, then go for it. Then build it up and build it up and build it up until you learn those new skills. And um, I'm the same. I've got jobs that uh, that I turned down. You know that I would maybe like to have a bit of a stab at. Um, it's different when you're charging people. Do you know what I mean? I, I feel like sometimes I feel like telling people, well. I'll do it for you, I'll do it for nothing, but I don't really know what I'm doing. And, <laughs> you know, I'm not sure how it's going to turn out. I'd love to say that and I'd love to learn on the job. You kind of do that though, can you, with, uh, you know, people's gardens. Uh, you know, that's why I like sort of messing about with my own garden and, and doing bits and pieces, you know. A lot of people on, on some videos that I've uh, published recently um, has talked about fencing, you know, being a good winter job. And um, I'm quite handy, you know, you know, with wooden stuff. And um, I think I would be able to definitely do fencing, but... You know, I'd have to watch some videos or something, you know, and, and learn that way a little bit. Um, I definitely would have the skills to do it, so, you know, maybe for next winter that's something I can get into. Um, but, yeah, just, just don't don't overcommit yourself, you know, in the beginning. Um, get used to running a business, you know, get get used to sort of being in regular contact with customers and, um, you know, going to multiple jobs a day. And uh, even if it's just grass cuts and strimming, you know, do it, but do it well, as I say. And uh, yeah, that's that's my number one piece of advice. Uh, so I hope that helps you. Cheers, guys. See you in the next one.